Welcome back. Well, it is a wonderful Friday because Miss Robin with DVR is in the building and you brought some wonderful fall finds. I did. You know, we've been talking for the last couple of months that blue is the color and, yeah. it, and we all love blue and we have it in our homes, but we're getting ready to start decorating for Thanksgiving. Our yeah. families are coming in and setting up all of those things. And how do we take some of those traditional Thanksgiving colors and add them into our blue? Yeah. So I brought some things, some items that we have at the store, some things that you may actually have at home, but maybe just to give you some different ideas on how you can incorporate Incorporate that yeah. and still keep your blue. Okay. I love that. So one of the things that I brought was I have some beautiful blue vases here, but I took and I added some fall That's foliage fall in here. These are some beautiful silks in here. We also have a vase here that has real cotton stems. So if you are a teacher or know of a teacher, that would be a great thing to introduce into your classroom during science time or whatever. Mm -hmm. We have these on special. They're 99 cents a stem. And That's they're a great deal. They're beautiful. They look great. That's three stems right there. So for okay. three, less than $3, that really fills, fills up a up. nice space. And it's perfect for the holiday. It is. So again, you'll notice I have some things lifted on risers because we love using risers. Uh, we have some of these natural tones in our pumpkins. So whether you're using some real pumpkins or you decide to go to some natural colors here, I've taken just very basic little cones. You can actually gather some out in your yard. I was going to say, the, these look like it, straight are, out of nature. That's right, exactly. But then you can take and add some little filler. We have great little boxes of filler, whether you opt to go with the orange or remember, we've had these before. Oh, yes. Cute these little guys. natural color with the little pumpkins. How cute are these? These are adorable, too. They are. So take them and put them in one of your dishes. Even just doing that gives you that touch of Thanksgiving, the touch of fall without again breaking the bank yeah we have some great little fall Thanksgiving plates here taking them actually putting them up on a plate stand okay. could be a great idea just to display them or even taking one and having it by the front door as a little drop zone area oh, there perfect. just that one little piece speaks volumes and I love this one how it I has the that. color in here all of this so, and they're all sold separately so whether you want color or you want it to be more neutral and then miss Robin I have a question so <laughs> you have these beautiful plates in a display Mm -hmm. Where would one put a display plate? Does well, it matter? Why not on your dining room table? Why okay. not put it in the middle there? Balance it out, do some symmetry, yeah. one on either end. Why not on a bookcase? You've yeah. got some books lined up. Take and put one on one shelf, maybe one on the other. That's all you would yeah. need. Just take and add a couple little things into your house. It could give your room and it could give you a whole new look. I feel like it takes the place of a, a photo. Yes, too, it because does. These are You're so right. Beautiful. Exactly. And speaking of photos, you know we always have our little clip art stands here. It's one of our local artists, Miss Renee. That's one of her pieces there. Uh, what something new that's just come in besides the cotton stems, we also got some great feathers. I love these feathers. We do They're too. So we love fun. the feathers. And the feathers have a wire in them so you can bend them up and down, make them, give them the look that you want. How easy to work yeah. with. And so, it just adds so much more to that arrangement. Yes, it did. Already. It most certainly did. And th perfect for Thanksgiving. I mean, you could actually even go right into Halloween from yeah. Thanksgiving, go all the way with these feathers. Thought that was a really cute little look there. And the last thing talking about for today is, so we've been working with blue. So what if I take my blue dinner napkins and okay. I go back, this napkin is maybe a little bit more spring or summer, but it's still kind of my Thanksgiving yeah. colors. What if I take it double it? Because I always like doing double napkins. What a cute little Thanksgiving ring here. So take and either slide it on and then look how we've oh, added beautiful. just a ring here and it makes a whole new look. And you still get that blue peeping out yes, on the side. Yes, we do. It's exactly. So nice. I love this. And we also have some rings and some different ones. I love this with the brown leather. Yeah. And then this one with a little natural wood look on here. So again, taking some simple things. It doesn't mean rearranging everything in the house or having to buy all brand new for the house. But take a couple of things and make that little pop in a living room, yeah. maybe a little touch in the kitchen, dining room table, and you're good to go. And then you can start cooking and getting ready for Thanksgiving. And get ready for every I just That's love it. this, too. Like, you always bring some beautiful pieces in store. Uh, it's just... I love well, I think love we do here. too, and we love blue. It's yes. one of my favorite colors. But I need to—I needed to know how can I take this blue color and incorporate all the holidays. And it in still it. feels like fall. It does. It still looks like fall in here. It does. It's a beautiful display getting into Thanksgiving, and we're going to come back and do the same thing 
but a little later on with Christmas. How can I take these home I colors it. and bring Christmas in without it being just all Christmas? I love that. Okay. We're, we're out of time, okay. but where are you located? We are 505 Jefferson Street, starting Tuesday, November 1st. The store is open from 9 until 5 every day. So we're open at 9 in the morning. Come to your shopping on our yeah. side of town first, and then head back maybe to the other side of town when they open up a little bit later. But we open at 9 o'clock. Perfect. Go visit Miss Robin. Just love this. If you want to learn more, head to our website, klaf.com. But Adam, let's check in with you.